Hey guys, just an update on our freezer to fridge conversion after 24 hour period. Um, now that we're using it, I have realized, first of all, it took everything we had in the big refrigerator. It's just more condensed and compact. It is awkward. I mean, it holds everything. The crisper is now on top instead of on the bottom uh, because this is the not as cold area whereas down there might be colder milk sets on the ledge and uh, everything else eggs are down in there drinks are down in there it works it, you can make it work all right it's just a little bit more uh, awkward to to work with but otherwise uh, we're doing all right now let me show you the power consumption after 24 hour period this guys is a kilowatt hours after a 24 hour period 0 0.32 kilowatt hours used let me make sure I have my light on there 0 0.32 kilowatt hours used in a 24 hour period on our new converted uh, chest freezer running as a refrigerator that is mind-blowing I just cannot believe the numbers but I've checked it again and again and again. I've heard about it. I've, I've read it online that these conversions are super, super efficient. But that's mind-blowingly incredible numbers. A third of a kilowatt, people. That is, that is only 300 watt hours of power. Imagine that. That's nothing. Let me take you out and show you a solar panel for comparison and tell you how much it's going to take to run this thing. Okay, guys. One of these, one of these panels in full sunlight for 1.5 hours will power that refrigerator in a 24 hour period. Just one of these little solar panels is a 200 watt solar panel. So in, a, in full bright sunlight at maximum power production for 1.5 hours will give you 300 watt hours of power, which is enough to run that refrigerator for an entire 24 hour period. That is really incredible. That is so exciting, these numbers. I am really, really impressed and pleased with our solar powered uh, freezer to fridge conversion. Uh, I didn't believe it. I, I'll, I'll be honest, I read the numbers online. I read it again and again and again that people have done this and I read it on forums and people who said that it's, they get these, these insanely low numbers below half a kilowatt. Um, some people claim crazy low numbers. And here we have it. Crazy low number. 0 0.3 kilowatt hours in a 24 hour period. I know I keep saying it. Sorry, I'm repeating myself, but I'm not. I find it incredible. It's hard to believe. So there you go, guys. Converting a chest freezer to a refrigerator is incredibly efficient. You could run it on a single deep cycle battery and a single solar panel with no problem. I might even do that just for fun one day.